Hi, this is Laptop Media, and maybe you've already come across our detailed review of the Acer Nitro 5. Today we'll be taking a look at 5 specific reasons to buy or skip out on this laptop. Immediately noticeable is the Acer Nitro 5's 15.6 inch IPS display that comes with a full HD resolution ensuring a pretty nice visual experience, especially considering the reasonably high contrast values and decent backlighting. Nowadays it's become of great importance that your laptop panel doesn't use pulse width modulation or PWM for regulating screen brightness since it leads to eye strain and other negative health impacts. This is exactly the case with Acer Nitro 5 which features a panel that is much easier on the viewer. The chassis is mainly made of plastic with the exception of the brushed aluminum lid and although putting some pressure in the middle leads to slight bending, the laptop feels well built all the way down to the smooth and linear travel of the hinges. On the bottom you'll notice the usual slightly roughened black plastic with two small service lids. The cooling solution gets the job done well for the AMD configuration we tested. During our extreme stress tests neither CPU nor GPU throttling occurred while the graphics card remained fairly cool. We already mentioned that the maximum brightness is fairly good while plugged in, however the display gets very dim as soon as you leave the charger, making the colors dull and subdued. So that's our list. If this laptop isn't right for you, you might want to consider some of the worthy rivals to the Acer Nitro 5, some of which we've already acquainted you with. Dell Inspiron 7567, Asus VivoBook Pro N580, Lenovo Legion Y520, and the HP Omen 15. You could also take a look at the 7th generation MSI GL62M and the Dell Inspiron 5577. Well, that's it for us today. Keep up to date with the latest on mobile computing at Laptop Media and as always, see you next time.